Well, strap up. It's a new week. I'm Darren, and this is Three Things You Need to Know for Monday, February the 12th. The Biden administration made official what many of us suspected already, which is companies are giving us less for more via shrinkflation. They want this to stop, but in the U.S., supply and demand will ultimately determine that. As long as there are choices to buy something cheaper and at a better unit cost, consumers who have to will choose a different company's product. Depending on where you work, your messages may be monitored. Companies like Delta, Chevron, Walmart, Starbucks, and more use software from Aware, which uses AI to anonymously give real-time stats and information about its employees. Anonymously? Hmm... It's already known that they have a different software called eDiscovery, which can reveal sources of severe threats if needed. Hello, big brother. It is a historic year for worldwide elections. With it comes a lot of tensions, which is the last thing the world theater needs right now. Over 50 countries decide their leadership this year. Pakistan is the latest in turmoil with calls of rigging elections. Trade while you're sleeping across time zones with Arbitrage Trade Assist. Sign up today at arbitragetrade.com. Arbitrage Trade is your trusted source for business, finance, and tech info. There are a lot of words I would use to describe my daughter. Kind, strong, hilarious. When I think about how much she's experienced in her life, we can't help but be inspired by her every day. So really, we are the lucky ones. Learn more at adoptuskids.org. Snacktastic! I understand you may be snacked out a bit after yesterday, but when that urge starts hitting again, here are some ideas. Melina writes, Hey there, snack enthusiast. Are you ready to turn snack time into an adventure? Say goodbye to the old boring options and get ready to tantalize those taste buds with some exciting ideas. Melina has you covered with these creative and fun suggestions. Set up a DIY snack station with a variety of ingredients like nuts, fruits, veggies, cheeses, and dips. Let your munchkins and munchkinettes mix and match their own combinations. This will empower them to create snacks that appeal to their unique tastes. Transform ordinary snacks into works of art. Use cookie cutters to shape fruits and veggies into fun shapes or arrange snacks on a plate to create playful designs like smiley faces or their favorite animals. Get creative and whip out a whipped cream or other tasty dips and sauces. Encourage your petite sous chefs to get creative and make their own edible masterpieces. Turn snack time into a fun game by arranging taste tests with blindfolds. Challenge their palates to guess the ingredients of different snacks or rate them on a scale of yumminess. You can even award prizes for the most adventurous taste testers. Make snack time more exciting by introducing theme days. From Tropical Tuesday with pineapple, kiwi, banana, or coconut snacks to Mexican Fiesta Friday featuring homemade salsa and guacamole. Tag on a different theme for the team from time to time to add a fun twist to your routine and encourage your tiny tots to try new flavors. Combine storytelling with snacking by choosing snacks that relate to your children's favorite books or movies. Try combining ingredients like cream, soda, butterscotch syrup, and whipped cream to create butter beer inspired by Harry Potter. Or create ants on a log while reading about insects. This not only makes snack time more engaging, but also encourages picky minis to connect with stories through food. By experimenting with these suggestions or inventing various types of customized snacks for your kiddos, she guarantees that snack time will never be bland again. From DIY snack stations to theme treats and everything in between, there are endless ways to make snacking fun and enticing for even the pickiest eaters. So why wait? Get ready to embark on a delicious journey filled with flavor, imagination, smiles, and happy bellies. Let's turn ingredients into magic, one bite at a time. Stop watching, start living using Pips, our AI bot. Go to arbitragetrade.com and check out Arbitrage Trade Assist. a pretty normal mom life. Everything was pretty good. And we just had a new baby, and then all of a sudden she's on life support and fighting for her life. They told me my only chance was a heart transplant. And the American Heart Association helped make that possible. Their research helped save me. To learn more about how the American Heart Association is saving lives, go to helpheart.org. Pips? Pick of the day! Is it avocado time again? Arbitrage algorithms have detected a possible uptrend for Calavo growers, that's CVGW, and they market and distribute avocados and prepared avocado products and other perishable foods. This was a past pick of the day mid-December and made 15% by the end of the month when it ran from $26.40 to $30.15 after the callout. And the probability has risen again, but never promised, of course. Closed Friday at 27.24, 52-week high of $38.97, 52-week low of $21.42. We are not financial advisors. We provide a service, and please do your own research. 
Arbitrage Trade Analytics LLC is a privately held research company. Arbitrage Trade Analytics LLC is solely responsible for the preparation and distribution of the contents of this podcast. The opinions offered in this podcast are for informational purposes only and are not intended to function as investment advice. Seek a duly licensed professional for investment advice. For more information about the informational research and services offered by Arbitrage Trade Analytics LLC, please visit arbitragetrade.com.